Hello guys, happy new year and welcome to the first SpaceX update video of 2023. We are off to a cracking start to the year with the successful launch of Transporter 6 mission. A Falcon 9 carrying 114 spacecraft lifted off from SLC-40 at Cape Canaveral Space Force Station in Florida at 9.56 a.m. Eastern Time. Amazon. This was the 200th overall launch for SpaceX, another milestone for the company. The first stage booster supporting this mission, Booster B-1060 was on its 15th flight and is now a joint record holder with B-1058 for being SpaceX's most flown booster in its fleet. After a clean and successful stage separation, the booster returned back to Earth and landed on landing zone 2 at Cape Canaveral. Stage 1 landing confirmed. It was such a nice and smooth landing. After 58 minutes into the mission, the successful deployment of all 114 payloads began which took over 30 minutes. Immaculate separation confirmed. Dragonfly Aerospace, EOS Sat-1, separation confirmed. 2023 is going to be such an important year for SpaceX with its Starship program. All eyes are on its South Texas Starbase launch site waiting for Elon's giant rocket to lift off from its launch pad. But, a lot of work on the important structures and testing on the rocket itself is a bridge to cross before SpaceX attempts to launch its interplanetary rocket. In the latest development at the test site, something like we never saw before is about to happen. From Starship Gazer's amazing coverage, we can see tons of counterweights being kept under the orbital launch mount. People are speculating that SpaceX will conduct a mass simulation test of nearly 5,000 tons on the orbital launch mount. A fully loaded full-stack Starship will weigh nearly equal to that weight. This rig will enable to test the hold-down clamps that will hold the Super Heavy booster during engine startup. The test will look something like this. Until this test is complete, I don't expect Booster 7 to roll out from the Mega Bay to the launch site to resume testing. But overall, this is a good sign of progress leading to the first orbital test flight of the Starship. Are you optimistic about the test flight in the first half of 2023 or later this year? That is it for now. If you enjoy short updates like this please don't forget to like the video.